माननीय सदस्य श्री मोहम्मद नदीमुल हक जी थैंक यू मैडम नीड टू रिलीज फंड्स अंडर एन एफ एस एड टू बेंगाल द यूनियन गवर्नमेंट हैज विथ हेल्थ द रिलीज ऑफ रुपीज सेवन थाउजेंड करोड टू अ स्टेट ऑफ वेस्ट बेंगाल टू प्रोक्योर पैडी अंडर द नेशनल फूड सिक्योरिटी एक्ट द स्टेट गवर्नमेंट हैज सक्सेसफुली acquired 8.52 lakh tons of paddy for the central pool this fiscal year the state aims to achieve 80% of its annual procurement target during the ongoing kharif season which extends until the end of february timely release of funds is crucial otherwise the entire procurement process may be affected the halt in funds to bengal stems from the need for nf sa logos and the prime minister's pictures to be put up across all ration shops in the state same, same, same. madam it is ridiculous that the union government is willing to jeopardize an entire state's food security over a delay in plastering the prime minister's image which is a time taking task same. this is the union's rational to withhold the funds so let me madam let me read out a quote from prime minister modi from 2018 and i quote federalism is no longer the fault line of center state relations but the definition of a new partnership in t of team india unquote however since the current government has come into power there has been a systematic deprivation of states pushing people into distress in regions where they are incapable of winning elections democratically madam the union government has blatantly carried out anti federal policies and engaged in fiscal federal terrorism denying bengal funds worth rupees 1 lakh crores under several schemes despite pleas from a chief minister party leaders and beneficiaries the union has chosen to remain indifferent this goes against the very spirit of the constitution this goes against the people of bengal i challenge you fight us democratically fight us in elections but do not make crores of people suffer for your political vendettas I urge this government to immediately reimburse rupees seven thousand crore for procuring paddy under the National Food Security Act. Thank you, Madam.